Good morning. It is um, Friday. It's just been one of those weeks, you know? Busy, running. Today, I'm hoping it's going to be different, although I've already been running. I had to take my mom <clears throat> for blood work this morning. So I did that, and then I, um, I went to Walmart grocery shopping haven't done that in a long time. I've just been coming to Wegmans and getting my fruit and stuff, but I needed a few other things and it's a little cheaper at Walmart. Not much, but a little. So that's why I went there first and got what I needed there. And then um, <clears throat> uh, um, what do I want to say here? Then I just went to Wegmans. So Got my fruit and veggies there. Um, I did get a, a small pack of strawberries at Walmart because they look good. But that, and then I got a bigger pack here. So I'll see which one's better. <clears throat> so I will show you my grocery haul today. Um, we had some plans change drastically today. Um, Roman's actually home from school, not feeling well. Um, I, I think. I know he's got a head cold. Um, it, it appears all the kids from the play got sick this week. Um, he said everybody's been off different days. And um, <clears throat> so he started like Wednesday night. He's like, uh, I kind of have a head cold going on. I'm like, all right, well, you know, he takes Tylenol, that's all. And so then um, yesterday he's like, I said, did you want to stay home? He's like, no, I'm all right, I'll go. I said, okay. So then I picked him up from school, took him to work. Uh, he, he only works two hours. Ray picked him up then and brought him home and they did the leaves because I actually had to work last night. Um, I had to sell tip boards because it was meat raffle night. So I sold the tip boards. Um, so I got a lot of exercise in, let me tell you. <clears throat> I was sweating so bad because, of course, it's warm out here. Um, it's warm and, you know, so nobody's got their air running anymore because a lot of people switched over to heat, but they turned the heat off. But it's tough to go back to turning the air on, so it's just been warm. <laughs> so I'm not complaining, though. It's actually gorgeous. Our trees, if you can see in the background, are so beautiful this fall. They are golden, they are bright red, they are orange. It's just so many beautiful, beautiful colors this year. I don't remember a fall with this many beautiful colors. Um, our two trees in our yard, our oak in the back is more than halfway um, down already. And then our maple is more than halfway down. So, uh, <clears throat> so it's been kind of, you know, they're falling real fast, so, but that's okay, you know, the more we can uh, get picked up and done. So, um, and the fire bushes, oh my gosh, they are like electric red. I mean, just so vibrant. When I pick my mom up, I'm like, holy cow, your fire bushes are beautiful. They, they all are this year. So, anyway, but just look at all these colors. So, so pretty. Um, <clears throat> it is my favorite time of the year. I love fall. Fall is my thing. Um, so, not much going on here. Like I said, I ended up working last night. Um, we're not sure if we're working Tuesday because of being Halloween. We're not sure if they're going to do their football booster meeting find out. I'm supposed to know soon. Uh, it don't matter to me either way because I'm working next Friday. I'm actually waitressing because the one so my sister Valerie is having, uh, she has a slight tear in something in her shoulder. <clears throat> she goes Tuesday for surgery. It's just a quick in and out surgery. Um, and then so she goes then and then the other girl that's a waitress at the club she is having her tonsils out so she can't work next Friday and Valerie can't work next Friday so they're like do you want a waitress 
I said, sure. So I'm going to waitress. So that should be quite interesting. <clears throat> and then, <clears throat> of course, I get on here to talk. <clears throat> and this is what happens to me all of the time. I hate it. I talked to my mom all morning and had no problem. Ugh. But anyway, um, so after I get done waitressing that night, um, I have to call bingo. <laughs> they have a bingo game at 8 o'clock in the evening, and they're like, we need you to call. I said, okay, I can call bingo. So, which will be kind of nice, because then, you know, I can sit and rest after being on my feet all afternoon. So, so that is quite interesting. Um, but, so I... After I get home today, I'm not planning on going anywhere else. We still don't have a pumpkin to carve yet. Um, I'm going to ask my son if he wants to stop, go up to the farm by our house, the farm stand, um, and grab a pumpkin because um, him and Ray carve it. That's one thing I do not care for is uh, carving pumpkins. And it was so funny because we always, before we had Roman, I have ceramic um, jack-o'-lanterns, so we used to always just do that, you know, stick the ceramic pumpkin out on the porch, and that was it, because it lights up and everything. Then when we had Roman, I'm like, oh, I guess we have to carve pumpkins, <laughs> so I said to Ray, that's going to be a project you can do with him. I do most of the other things, you do that, because I do not like that at all. I just, I don't like the smell. I don't like the texture, the sliminess. It's just not me. You know, I don't like that stuff. So, um, we still have to get a pumpkin for them to carve. Uh, I don't know when we're going to carve. Well, maybe Sunday night they can carve it because tomorrow's, uh, um, you know, tomorrow Ray and I will go to breakfast. Then we go do the rosary, which is the last Saturday for that. Um, and then I take Roman to piano and then I take him to work. Then I go home and then Ray will be home. Um, and then he's got to leave a little before one because it's the band show downtown. So he's got to go down there and, you know, park the buses when they come in and stuff. Um, so then he'll be gone. And then when I pick Roman up from work. If he's feeling all right, he'll go right to the stadium and help Ray for the rest of the night. And then, then they'll come home. But it's usually, they're not, usually not home till like 10 o'clock. Um, and then Sunday, we have our last cheese. This is the last week for pierogi. It's been a long five weeks of pierogi, let me tell you. So we have our last cheese and then we have church. And then we have to take Roman, drop him off at school because he has open house. And then, um, and we go home and then he gets picked up at three. And then that's it for the day. So I'm thinking if we can grab a pumpkin today or tomorrow, they should be able to carve it on Sunday night. They can carve it. So, um, so we have to do that. That's our weekend. My hope this weekend is, I think I said it in my video that you're going to see probably today, is to um, get my carrots all done, bagged up and uh, frozen. And um, so tonight, so the original plan today was Roman only, he only has half a day of school anyway today, so he's only missing a half a day. But uh, <clears throat> the plan was to, you know, him go to school. I was going to pick him up. Oh, no. Well, that was the original plan. That got scrapped. His, the florist that he works for, they are bringing stuff oh, goodness, to set up for open house. So they told him, just stay at school. We'll meet you there. You can help us unload everything and stuff. And we'll take you back to the shop with us. So I wasn't even going to have to pick him up today. And then Ray was going to get him tonight. And then it, uh, the club is having Swiss steak for dinner. And so they're like, let's go to the club for dinner. I'm like, all right. I don't eat that stuff, though. 
so I was just going to have fish. But with him staying home, I said, let's just stay home, Roman. And I said, um, if you want to stay home, that's fine. But I said, we are going to, uh, I'm going to make Italian bread pizza. So I actually bought Italian bread, a loaf of Italian bread, and I'll cut it up. And then um, I just put a little olive oil on the bottom and then sauce, cheese, and pepperoni. Um, and I might saute up some mushrooms and onions to put on Ray and mine. Roman don't like that. Um, but we'll just have Italian bread pizza tonight. Um, so that's the plan for that. Because since I have to, I actually had Italian bread pizza on for tomorrow. Oh, hold on. Okay, here's my grocery haul. I hope you can hear me because my son is out power washing stuff. So, um, I've got a big bag of red grapes. I got red raspberries for lunches. I got two strawberries. I got this one at Wegmans. I got this one at Walmart. They look good though. So we'll see which one's better. I got pears for my husband for his lunch. He likes to have a pear in his lunch. I got some my favorite lettuce for my salads. I try to have my salads every day this week, my cucumbers to go with it. I do still have a basket of tomatoes we picked from the garden last night, so that is that. <clears throat> and then I got, um, this is what I used in that chicken chili last week, and so I just want to put one back on the shelf because I don't have any more. This is my favorite red wine vinegar to use. Then for the boys for lunches, I got them oven roasted turkey breast and black forest ham. And then I also put a piece of cheese on their sandwiches and they like the hot cheese. So I got a big pack of it. It'll last me a while. I got a light sour cream because I'm thinking maybe I'll do baked potatoes this week. Um, I got two of the mozzarella. I got a yellow sharp and a white sharp and a Colby. And you can throw my old shoes just up there. Yeah, hey, hold on. Hey, sorry for the interruption. Uh Wegmans had their white potatoes on sale for $1.99, so that's what I'm going with this week. And then this is the Italian bread I'm using. I don't know if it's really yeah, oh my gosh, now my phone's ringing. Anyway, this is my Italian bread. Thin sliced for pizza tonight. Okay, I've made it into my room. Um, I don't have any lights on yet. <sighs> this is what my life is like all day long. People calling, texting, needing questions answered. Okay, so I wanted to show you what I got in the mail. I pre-ordered it. I couldn't wait till it came in. Ta-da! The Pioneer Woman's new cookbook, Dinner's Ready. I have not gone through this. It's going to be either tonight or the weekend. Uh, um, I don't know if you know, but I love, love, love the Pioneer Woman. She's my one of my favorites to watch and to um, do recipes from. So I think this weekend I'm going to go through all her books and come up with a, my November menu because I have not done that yet. Um, and that's next week, uh, next Wednesday. So... And then the other thing I want to show you is my my spread for next week and my planner. I love it. So, of course, it's Halloween-ish. So, it is so cute. Look at those stickers. How stinking cute is that? So, that is the planner for next week. Um, I'll just tell you what the plan is for dinners. Um... Monday I'm going to make goulash because it's something I can do in the um, crock pot and then just eat um, before we go do our last pierogi night. Um, Tuesday pizza was on the menu, but my neighbor who just had a baby is sending us dinner. I'm like, no. She's like, no is not an answer. <sighs> We're both equally good to each other. It's like, I'm like... You, you, you just had a baby. Quit spending your money. But they're insisting on buying us. So we're getting sandwiches. Um, Wednesday next week, I'm going to try to make a chicken pot pie. Um, we have 
uh, well, ne so Halloween, I have an eye appointment. I cannot wait to, to get new lenses because these are so terrible. Um, so I have an eye appointment at nine o'clock on Tuesday morning. And then Wednesday, I have a dietitian appointment at 9.30. And then we have 5.15 mass because it's All Saints Day. And that is a holy day in the Catholic Church. Um, so my hope, I think I'm going to have the chicken pot pie done and ready. And then just like take it out of the oven before I leave for mass. Because I'll just probably, I'll meet the boys there for church. Because Roman, no, it's Wednesday. So no, I will pick Roman up from school and we will meet Ray at church. So I'll take it out before, right before we go to church so that when we come home we can eat and it'll, it should still be warm and stuff. Um, Thursday, I have nothing. So I am I have two pork loins and I wanna make one. So I have pork loin on the schedule for, t for Thursday. Um, now Friday I work, next week I work double I waitress from three until seven, and then I, um, I waitress from three to seven, and then I'm calling bingo from eight until probably like almost 11. So it's gonna be a very long day for me, but I'm gonna put stuffed peppers in the crock pot for the boys to eat um, so they can have that. And Roman works that day too. He has a half a day next Friday. He had one today and he has one next Friday. Um, so he'll go into work early I'll drop him and then go to work myself. Um, and then next Saturday, the plan, we're going to have to go to church um, on Saturday next week. So my plan is to have sausage, but I'll probably have it um, like with sauerkraut or rice. I usually, I usually make it with something. Um, so we'll have sausage with something. Um, and then sun Sunday, I have no plans for eating because Ray will be doing, I'll be helping him get set up for this. We have an election party at our church. It's a traditional thing. They do it twice a year for election. And then, so the, he, Ray will probably eat there. I don't know if I will. They have, I mean, they have normal stuff like hot dogs, oxtail sandwiches, sausage sandwiches, wings, french fries. So I don't know if I'll eat there or I have to pick Roman up from the train show at four and we have an hour and a half to kill, so we might maybe stop and grab something to eat then. I don't know. I'm just not sure that day is going to be a hot mess. <laughs> so, but that's my planner for next week. Um, and I turned into November, and I think I told you before how much I love, 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 like blues and stuff for fall. And this is my November calendar stickers. How cute is that? I love the, the white and the blues. It's just my favorite. So that is that. I don't have everything written on my calendar yet. I don't have um, a lot of stuff written yet because it's not quite November, but I will get stuff going on there. Um, so that's about it so that is my planner for next week for halloween week that's what i'm gonna have on my menu um i gotta work on my definitely need to work on my november menu um i have been doing a menu every month i'll show you what it looks like um so <laughs> i write it all out and then what is X'd off is what is what I was able to make. What is circled is what I ha did not get to make. Um, so what I'll do is I'll go to do up November's and I will mark, you know, like I was going to do a cheeseburger pasta. It's just a recipe I saw on Pinterest. Um, I have ranch steaks in the freezer from Butcher Box and, you know, my pork loin. So um, but this I can cross off because we're having it tonight. My Italian bread pizza. So, uh, and it's actually on the right day and everything. Um, so it's just stuff I didn't get to make that, uh, I want to make. Um, so, oh my God. I did not sleep good last night. I don't know why. I've been having the craziest of dreams. But, so I'll get my, um, 
November calendar, November menu going and carry over what I didn't use on this one and, and um, go from there. So that I think is everything I'm updating. My son, he, he's homesick, but he's, it's just a head cold and I think he just needed to rest a little this morning. You know, that play and all those weeks of all that rehearsal till 5.30, 6 o'clock, sometimes 6.30, and then tech week is what they call the week of the play. Um, they were, they rehearsed from 5.30 till 10. So um, that's a lot. It's, it's just, I, I felt like he's hardly home and I know it's only four years of his life. It goes by so quick, but um, after a while, I think your body tells you slow down or get rest. And I think he was to the point of, I just need to rest. So he did email his teachers this morning and stuff. Um, I, of course, emailed the school and told him he would not be there. So, um, uh, so that is that. Um, he even called off work today, so um, he's just going to be home all day. So he's outside pressure washing the patio and my stone stuff that I wanted to get cleaned up. And then he wants to do the driveway, so we'll see how this goes. It always makes such a mess, but it always looks so nice when it's done. So, And then probably later this afternoon, I told him we're going to have to do leaves again. They're, they're just falling so fast. It's, I don't know why they are. I mean, normally leaves, you know, we'll be like picking leaves up for weeks, but it's like, it's only been like about a week and like our trees are more than half down already. So, so anyway, but we do have the windows open. It is supposed to be warm yet tomorrow. It's supposed to be in the sixties. Um, it's Sunday when it starts going downhill, but it is supposed to be a rainy weekend. Um, Oh gosh, which I'm fine with. Um, but what I have, I actually have a to-do list. I wonder if I can cross anything off now. I have stuff I want my husband to do. I told you I have shelves to put up. I am going to probably this weekend put the glass back in our doors. Our screen doors have screens and then they have glass also for the winter and stuff. So I'll do that. Um, no, I cannot cross anything off my list. So I have... I'm going to make up my mixture for my English muffins and let it sit overnight. Um, carrots are on the list for me and my English muffins for this weekend. Um, I also might make a dessert. I'm not sure. Oh my gosh, I don't know why I'm yawning all of a sudden. I'm not sure what I want to make, but I do want to make something um, this weekend. And I think that's about it. Um... And then just do simple things around the house. I'm still, I have one more load of laundry to do. I have the towels going right now, but I have actually one more load of clothes. So as soon as I get those done, I am I'm probably have a problem or ADHD or whatever you want to call it. I cannot, like, my clothes have been sitting here for two days, folded. But I'm not putting them away because I have another load to do. And I'm like... I said to my husband, I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't want to put those away until I have that last load done and folded and I could put it all away. Is there something wrong with me? <laughs> I just want them, and I haven't been home, so I'm not looking at these piles of clothes sitting here. I mean, they're all folded and I fold them on the back of my couch, but I just have not, I just have one last load to do today, which I had. I, I had church laundry to do this week. I've had a whole bunch of stuff I've been trying to get done. Um, cause I brought the towels home from pierogi making and there's a ton of them. So it's like four loads of laundry. So the last load is in the dryer right now. And then I have, I put, I have one load of my towels that needs to get dried yet. And cause I had to run my dryer twice because these towels are so big and heavy and so I had to run my dryer again, just for like another 30 minutes. And then I'll put my one, my first batch of towels of our towels in, and then I have another batch of towels in the wash right now. Then I have one last load of laundry for us. And I, then I'll get all that put away today. And then Roman's gonna bring his laundry down for me. 
I'll do his laundry over the weekend because I'll get his uniforms all washed up. And let me tell you, though, it is so nice now having all the uniforms I need to have for him. And I'll have to worry about it, you know, washing them during the week. So, um, but as of Tuesday, let me think. Let me look on my calendar. As of Tuesday, yes. Starting Halloween, they have to wear a dress uniform. Um, so in the in first quarter and fourth quarter is polos. Second and third quarter is um, Oxfords with tie, which is also called dress uniform. So uh, for the next two uh, quarters, he's got to wear a dress uniform. So um, so the polos will be put away, but he'll have to wear his um, his good shirts so which is blue they can wear blue or white oxfords i don't know who thought they should wear white but this child of mine is not getting white so um, my neighbors are so funny their trash cans are right outside their kitchen window so that's how they throw them in the garbage i guess it's pretty handy um she was throwing a bad garbage out so anyway, so that is that. So I'll just do his stuff over the weekend, get his all done and have him put them away. And then um, I'll be good to go, hopefully. Because the laundry starts all over Monday. I hate when laundry lingers, but when I, I wasn't home so many days this week, I did take my mom to get blood work this morning. And uh, then she's like, oh, by the way, her brother, my uncle David, he's my godfather too. Um, he has to have a colonoscopy and so he's got to schedule it. And they're supposed to call him. Well, they haven't called him yet. So he's getting all ticked off. So he's like, I'm calling them today. So he's supposed to call, call them and get this set up. And he's like, do you think Edith could take me? So he just goes, he goes and has it done at the hospital. You can go to the hospital or the outpatient stuff but he likes to go right to the hospital so I can't close my door all the way I got half the stuff in the bathroom in here Ollie because my husband's got the bathroom torn apart it's just a mess here I just I hate it right now but anyway so my mom's like oh I'm sure she could take you I'm like, well, it depends on what day it is, you know? I'm like, I ever just thinks I'm at their disposal. I and then I don't know. I'm 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 starting to feel depressed about things like this cuz I'm just like I guess it don't matter. Like I can't have a life or do anything cuz I've got to do for everybody else. And it's starting to really bother me. Well, it must be something serious walking by. All right, I'll let you go. You'll probably get two videos from me today. So I'll see you all maybe over the weekend and show you all the fun stuff I'm doing. We'll see. So have a great weekend.